Hi guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to try and do this. Hopefully the battery isn't going to go because it's flashing at me. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to quickly do a get ready with me to go geocaching. If it dies on me, I'm just going to have to change my phone so the quality might change. But yeah, so I'm going geocaching today. If you've seen on my um, vlogging channel, I, me and my sister go geocaching um and i vlog it so that's why i'm doing a little get ready with me because i do put makeup on to vlog but yeah so let's get started i'm kind of going to do a little update as well whilst i put makeup on um the first thing that i'm going to use is i've already like washed my face and moisturized it and stuff um but i then i'm then going to put some spf on just because yeah i kind of use it as like a little base as well um but yeah so I'm gonna pop this on. I have got the little mirror here because otherwise I don't know what I'm doing. But like a little goes a long way, so it's not too bad. If I look down, it's because I put the mirror down here. I don't know where it's best to put the mirror actually. How's everybody been? Pop down in the comments how you are. I'd love to know. Um does anybody know what geocaching is? Because I didn't know what it was until my sister introduced it to me. Um, and I absolutely love it. It's the only way it'll, like, the only reason I'll go out walking is because there's a lot of geocaches there. Um, <laughs> I like to have a little bit of fun when I'm walking because I find walking really boring. Um, so that's kind of like something that will help me get out and like literally walk around. Um, where is my brush? There it is. So, that SPF was from the Body Shop, by the way. Um, I'm now going to go in some with some MAC concealer. It's the clay concealer. If you're hearing that clicking, it's the heat and turning off. Um, and this is in NC10, and it's Studio Finish Concealer. And it's actually got SPF 35 in it, so that's always good. Oh, it's broke, man. That's never happened before. <laughs> the little clear case has just come off on it. It's all right, click it back in. Oh, it looks like I've cracked it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Anyway, I'm going to go in with the concealer and just pop it on any redness and any spots that I have. Have, just to conceal that a little bit um anyway back to geocaching that sun see it it's reflecting um yeah so geocaching is like it's a bit like a treasure hunt um so basically people will go and hide like these little containers that have got like it's kind of like a little sat, like a little log to sign to say that you found it. And some of them actually have like um, little like treasures in them that you can swap around and you can take and replace and stuff like that. Um, I think it's a really cool idea, especially for like kids to get them out wanting to walk. I think it's like a really good idea. Or like people like me that don't actually like going out um, walking. It's a bit of like fun and a little bit of like. I don't know, something to do rather than just go on a, like, a plain walk. Um, but I really enjoy it. My sister really enjoys it. Um, but it's not very common. So not a lot of people know about it. Like, I didn't know about it, like I said, until my sister introduced it to me. I don't know how she knew about it. Um, but my dad knew about it before I did. He was like, yeah, I've seen it on TV. Um... But yeah, I've done quite a few videos now on it, on my vlogging channel, which is Eyes Hair of Vlogs, by the way. Um, and yeah, I just really enjoy it. And me and my sister have actually hidden our own as well. You've got to have like 50 finds to hide your own. And yeah, we've, man we've gone way over. Oh no, it wasn't 50. I think it was like 25, something like that. I don't know. Anyway, we it might have been 20. I can't remember. Anyway, we've managed to, like, we've hid two of ours now and a lot of people have found them. The only annoying thing is that one of mine keeps going missing. It's like somebody's finding it and just, like, getting rid of it. 
because it's under something. It's not like it's in view of the wind. It's like literally under a bridge. <laughs> um, so it's not like, yeah, it's not like it's out in the open and it's not like the wind can like move it, if that makes sense. But yeah. Now I'm just going in with the Beauty Blender and just blending that in. I like to dab it. A lot of people like to wet the Beauty Blenders, but I don't like the the feel of it wet, the texture. So yes, I'm probably gonna trigger people here by using a non-wet Beauty Blender, but I have a fit, I like a phobia of it wet. <laughs> I don't know, it's weird, but yeah. I've literally got like 10 minutes before I've got to be out. I told my sister half one, I'm always late. In fact, no, I'm not late. She she thinks, yes, Tracy, if you're watching this, she thinks that when I say like a time, it means we're meeting at that time. No, it means I'll be ready by that time. <laughs> so I probably will be ready, I just won't be there to meet her at that time. Mm -mm -mm. I'm really bad at talking and doing makeup, not gonna lie. So that is all blended in. I have this really annoying like bit of skin here. That's really, really annoying. Um, but then we're gonna go in with some foundation. This is the Body Shop um, Bally Vanilla 020 Fresh Nude Foundation. And again, this has got SPF in it. Really SPF up. <laughs> I just realized what that sounds like then. But yeah, so we're just gonna put some on the hand and get a brush. And um, this is a Real Techniques buffing brush. Um, and I'm gonna just go in all over with my foundation. I don't even know if this is the right shade for me, but I always use it and no one said anything. It's probably not. I'm not like a professional at makeup. <laughs> it's just doing what is good for me. Um. But yeah. So anyway, back to geocaching. I said this was going to be a little update video as well, but I'm probably just going to talk about geocaching. Um, today we're going on to some local ones, but it's like a drive away. Um, you could probably walk for it, but it'd take forever. As we figured out last time we walked to that place. Um, there's some that we we tried to find that had gone missing um but they've been replaced now so we're going to try and get them ones again and then there's a new trail that we're going to try to and hopefully we can find them make sure i get that neck area and the ears yeah. these these little bits of hair are really annoying me mm -hmm. But yeah, anyway, has anybody else been geocaching? Because it's my favourite thing to do when I'm going to walk now. Like, if I visit some places now, I'll check to make sure to see if there's any like geocaches because they have an app where you can check whether there's some and then it leads you to them and then you've just got to try and find it. I just think it's really fun um, and I love it. But yeah, so anyway, updates. Have I got any updates with life right now? Um, I don't know, but I'm going in with this, the Body Sharp, um, little clay powder, cons like full, full coverage press powder, um, and I'm just going to put that all over my face. Um, I accidentally ordered this once instead of con some concealer, and I'm glad that I ordered it now. It's probably going to go all over me though, because I've got black on. I just blew it all over me, that was great. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of... I'm just gonna like put it all over my face to kind of set the um, foundation, and then it also like gets any spots that I've missed because it's like it's not transluc translucent. It's got a colour to it which matches my um, foundation. So 
and concealer so if i've like missed any points of like coverage and stuff it will just get it all if that makes sense anyway updates have i got any updates for you um i don't think so i'm hopefully like with work and stuff like i i work in an opticians i'm not going to say which opticians um and i'm hopefully going to be um what's it called training up to become like first of all it's to become i've got i've got cramp in my foot because of how i've been sitting um first of all it's kind of to be like qualified with what i'm doing at the moment like i'm not a knocked on so i can't check people's eyes um and basically um yeah so i'll be qualified in what i'm doing and then i can carry on if i want to and do my next one um which means i'll be more qualified doing other things as well and i can just keep going up so that's good like it's the first job that's actually like letting me do something that i want to do because i've always wanted to um train up i'm like oh i've got it all over me that's because i'm trying to talk whilst i'm doing it yeah so anyway I <laughs> well, i've not even said what um <laughs> mascara i'm using it's the body shop again um it's called happy go lash mascara um, it's just in this cute little container. You can tell I used to work for the body shop, can't you? Um, yeah, so. I don't even remember what I was saying now. I think I was saying about training up at work. That's really good. I've nearly done with my makeup. I'm only having like a cash today. <laughs> this is a little like quick makeup routine. Um, right, I need to get rid of this black on me. The only problem is I don't use makeup wipes anymore. So I'm just going to see if this beauty blender will get it off or oh, is it no it's not gonna is it i wonder if i go in with some concealer it will get it off it'll brighten up the under eyes as well if i do uh, i'm just going back in with that clay clay concealer and doing the under eyes I don't normally do this, but yeah, we're doing it. It's just clearly because I've got no conceal, I've got no baby wipes, so we're just gonna conceal the blackness that I just did. And I'm sure it'll brighten up the under eye too. I've got it on the top of my lids. Oh well. I'll sort that out later. <laughs> and then I'm just going to go back in with that pressed powder. Just because, obviously, I've just done my under eyes again. Just so it matches. Oh, this brush that I've been using for the powder, by the way, is called is a contour brush. But I don't use... I don't know how to contour, so I don't contour. <laughs> not gonna lie um yeah so that's pretty much it um i'm just gonna get some i've literally broke it that's why it's falling out um yeah i'm just gonna get some lippy this stuff um that i used in my favorites video last week um it's the lavender lip balm um that i did in my favorites i'm just gonna put that on This is literally my favourite lip balm. And then we're going to take the bobble out because I hate having my hair up. And then I'm just going to... I'm scared of doing this because I don't normally wear mascara, but I just know it's going to go everywhere. But we'll... Oh, no, it's not. It's all good. Um, This little, like... It's Mario, and I can never pronounce the name, as I said in my favourites, um, from Beauty Bay. And it's the facial spray with aloe vera, herbs, and rose water. And then I'm just going to go like this. And 
that is my little get ready with me it's probably boring um but i just thought i would yeah have a little chatty get ready with me um and a little bit of a life update on work which i'm so excited about and also we've got some good vlogs coming up as well um so if you're not subscribed to my vlogging channel go subscribe i serve vlogs and yeah um i've actually got a, a vlog i just posted one and i should be having another one up because i'm vlogging this geocaching one as well so yeah that's good but yeah just want to say thank you so much for watching and i'm surprised my battery's held out for this long but yeah thank you for watching and i'll see you next time with another video bye